Hello YouTubers, welcome back to Yorkshire Media. I am Mark, your host, your presenter, whatever you want me to be. Yes, I am better better and cheaper than the BBC. Capiche? I'm not going to stop saying it. So, here we go. So, what are we talking about? Well, what we are talking about is the 40 year old version. The longer you work, the harder it gets. That's what I'm going to be doing a film review. So, it's Wednesday's film review. And um, yeah, so the 40 year old virgin Steve Gavel's in this. It is, yeah, better late than never. 40 year old Andy Steiser, Steve Carroll has done a, quite a few things in his life. He's got a cushy job at an electronics superstore, a nice apartment with proud collection of action figures but there's just one thing he hasn't gotten around to doing yet and he's never ever had sex and not even by accident a big deal well and his boat and the star it sure it all they think is a bit of oddball they consider it their duty to help Andy out of this dire situation, but nothing works until he meets Trish, Catherine Keener, 40 year old mother of three, and Andy's friend are psyched by the possibility that it may finally happen until they hear about an amazing arrangement between the two lovers. And that raised me is that he's not to have sex until they're about 20 dates, basically. He's a virgin. Yeah, 40 year old virgin is Steve Carroll. And it all starts out. He meets Trish and that. And he, and he does really fancy it, yeah. But his friends, you know, speed it and things like that. It, nothing ever. It doesn't work. Yeah, you know I mean, like I say, he's, he's, he's an electronic star, so, you know, a cushy job and things like that. But in the end, he, he, he does meet Trish and he does go out and they have this arrangement where they don't have sex for at least 20 days, basically. And that's how it works. Because he's scared to tell her that he's a virgin. Her daughter knows he's a virgin because Andy he takes her, to, he's the, her daughter to the clinic, basically. And he says, yeah, I'm a virgin, and, you know, just to help her out she's a virgin things like that it's not a big deal so yeah I mean, everything works out in the end you know he, he, he managed Trish and that and yes he does have sex eventually yeah so that's it really that's the 40 year old virgin it's a good comedy I like it it's well written they've got the right people involved um, I think Seth Logan's in this as well and things like that, but yeah, it is, it is well written, it's, it's well put together and filmed very nicely and I think the script does it justice, I really do, I think Steve Carroll plays a very good part in all of this, you know, as, a, uh, you know, as the 40 year old virgin, I mean, you know, there's nothing wrong with that, yeah, never seen it, you know, the longer you work, the harder it gets. Which it can be true, you know. It can be, you know. What I mean, can you imagine going through all all the way of your life? You get to forty and you're still a virgin. Yeah, you know I mean, must be a shocker, really, at the end of the day. But it's a good comedy. I like it. It, it really is. I, you know, you know, would I recommend it for you, for, for anyone to put in the collection? Yeah, I would. It's it's really watchable. It's just one of those things. If you need a good laugh, you need something to calm you down and things like that. This works every time. Um, I've I've seen this now quite a few times, and things like that. And, and I definitely like it. But I thought I'd watch it tonight because I knew I had to do a film review on Wednesday. On, on Wednesday, so this is why I've done this. So at the end of the day, yep, yeah, it's a really good comedy. Lots of laughs. I mean, it had me had me stitches on alien tears. You know what I mean? And things like that. So there you go. It's a very good comedy, so yes, I do. I I do recommend this. Anyone 
who was a collector to have this in their collection. I think it's a very good film. If you haven't watched it, by the way, please do watch it. Um, you know, you might have a different opinion on this. You know, you know, some people might not like it, but at the end of the day, I like it. It's a good comedy. It really is. Steve Kettle's a great actor. So, yeah. So if you've liked that review and, you know, please give me the thumbs up. Please like the video. Please subscribe if you're new. Hit the bell icon. It all that will let you know when I'm putting up another video. Also, share the video out to your friends and your family. And to other, other social media like Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Twitch, Bing. And also, comment below. And I'll catch you on the next one. Bye for now. Catch you all later. Bye.